101. Guys, I am so excited to announce that I have just reached 101 subscribers. Yes, you heard it. I just can't believe it. After all this time and like all these years, three whole years of being on YouTube, I have finally reached 101 subscribers, three digits. And let me tell you, it feels really good. <laughs> so um, the other day I reached 100 subscribers and I was like, okay, I need to make like a 100 subscriber special video and got home and I have 101 now. Yes, I'm very excited and I have some things I want to show you in this video. I'm going to show you my studio, which I've been working on the past few months and um, our new guinea pig setup with our guinea pigs. And um, at the end of this video, I'm going to show you the bloopers from our last video, Hotspot, which should be really, really good. <laughs> So without further ado, let me take you down into the studio. And here it is. Okay, so keep in mind, this is our basement, which had been a storage area for a very long time. And um, yeah, so, so far I've cleared out about half of our basement and coated the floor so that it's not like all chalky. And um, yeah, all the junk is like, we shoved it all over to this other side and threw out like a whole ton of it. And this side is kind of like our hangout area now and studio stuff. So right here um, is the backdrop. I have a green screen, a white screen, and um, a black one. In the hotspot we use the green screen, which is really cool. And here, um, this used to be like a big open area. So we had this old mattress that was just down in the basement and um, we cleaned it up and set it up here because actually we have a projector set up right here too. So we can, wa we can watch uh, movies and stuff. It's pretty cool. You can just like lay down on the bed and watch movies. It's pretty great. Over here we have some studio lights, um, this one here, this one over here, um, these are actually umbrella lights, I don't have the umbrellas on them yet, or not right now, but um, I actually have these special light bulbs in here that are also speakers, which is really cool, Bluetooth speakers, and that's also a Bluetooth speaker, and that's a Bluetooth speaker. So we have like surround sound when we're watching movies, it's really awesome. And um, over here, you can see the guinea pig cage. It's a big upgrade from what they used to live in. They used to live in that little kiddie pool. Now they're down here and it's uh, a lot better for them. So this side's usually the girl's side and this is the boy's side. But this actually opens up here so that they can play together. And um, we usually let them do that about once a day. And we just keep our eyes on them, make sure that, <laughs> you know, Nothing crazy goes on. So this is Edna. You know her. She was in the interview, Miss Edeny. Um, she's my daughter. And um, that's, that's just ran away. That's Coco Marshmallow. He's one of the boys. And um, that's Gin. She's the original, our first skinny pig. That's Caramel Cream. Which actually, she was just sick a few days ago, but luckily she's getting better, so that's good. That's TT, aka Potato. I don't know uh, where that name came from. My sister just started calling her Potato, so yeah. <laughs> and um, under this tunnel is the newest member of our family. A. Hey. No. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he's um, he's the other boy. Because Coco used to be alone over on this side. So now we have um, Edwin, who's now Coco's friend. He's a little rambunctious, he's still a baby, but um, his nickname is actually Sheep because he looks like a little sheep. <laughs> he's so cute. They have like nice lights I set up around to make it nice and cozy for him. And uh, yeah. And over back here is what we call the alley because it's like, um, Kind of like a back area, I don't know. Um, this is kind of like my main editing area where I have um, my laptop and uh, 
get all my stuff like my, my microphone up on this thing so that I can like record voiceover and stuff like that and um, I don't know I tried to make it feel a little more cozy back here because this was always like the creepy area of the basement because it has the velcro doors which is creepy but I tried to make it um, a little more cozy down here so yeah so I might make um like an update video on when we got everything like in its final condition and all polished up it should be pretty nice okay so now before I show you the bloopers to the video a hot slap video um I wanted to just talk about some things that I think are important um to just let you guys know about um so you probably noticed that uh I've been posting videos more of around the lines of once a month when I usually say that I try to post about once a week um so I really like to post once a week like I think that's a good like time frame um I should start from the beginning <laughs> ever since I found out about or heard about YouTube and um found out that you could actually make money from YouTube I thought that was really cool like I always thought like well, that sounds like the greatest thing, like, making money off of YouTube videos, like, that's so cool, like, because I've always loved, like, making home videos and stuff like that, because it's just, like, I always thought it was super fun and stuff, um, but, um, so yeah, I started my, this YouTube channel about three years ago, I think, and, um, I wasn't always consistent with my posting, but for a while I was posting videos, like, once a week, like, on a grind trying to get to 10,000 views, because, um, if you guys didn't know, um, it used to be on YouTube, if you reach, I think, yeah, 10,000 views all together, like, all your videos combined, that's when you can become monetized on YouTube, which means you make money from your videos and stuff like that, um, and so, ever since I started my channel three years ago, that was, like, my goal, I was trying to reach 10,000 views, so, maybe two years in, or so, about that, I finally reached 10,000 views, which I was super excited about, because then I thought that I could become monetized, and um, I just thought that would be an extra bonus, because I already love making the these videos, and I thought, oh well, if I'm making money from it as well, that's like great, it's a win-win, because I love doing videos and, and making money from it, so yeah, um, but then I went to set up the monetization on YouTube and apparently they changed their terms of service so instead of getting 10,000 views and becoming monetized you have to reach 1,000 subscribers yeah and this was kind of like a blow in the face to me kind of because I had been working about two years trying to reach that 10,000 views and I finally reached it and then all of a sudden I have to reach 1,000 subscribers so yeah that kind of put me down in the dumps a little bit so i was kind of slacking on my video posts and i kind of still am but i'm feeling really a lot better now and i think i might be able to keep on posting a little more frequently because i've got all this equipment because i'm really trying to up my videos and like put out the best videos possible for you guys and um now that I have 101 subscribers, I mean, if you think about it, it's not even, I'm not even that far from a thousand, it's only 900 more, which I know it sounds like a lot, but less than a year ago, I had, I was at maybe 30, or I don't know, 30 subscribers maybe? Yeah, so like, it took me two years to slowly get to 30 subscribers, but in this one year, I've got all the way up to 100, and one so that's really great news because i think it's like i'm getting this car rolling kind of which is really great because it always takes like determination kind of and like um you know i don't know where i'm going with this actually but what i'm trying to say is that i'm excited that i have 101 subscribers and it's all thanks to you guys and um yeah Here's to another 101. <laughs> Until we get to 1,000. I can't wait to get to 1,000. And I know it's coming around the corner. I feel good about where I'm at right now. And um, yeah, I'm just really excited for what the future holds. And um, I 
I hope you guys will come along on this journey with me. So without further ado, uh, let's get into those bloopers because I know you want to see them, hopefully. Oh, hi, see you there. Welcome to Hotspot, the greatest show on this planet Earth. <laughs> Stop! Lewis oh, hi, welcome to Hotspot, the show that everyone loves. <laughs> what is wrong with <laughs> Oh, hi, didn't see you, know, you there. You guys trying to go to um, uh, Burger King and get our free sandwich? <laughs> Knew it would happen. That's Knew it. I'm not going to burn. Oh Today we have our special guest, Dr. Doof and Schmertz. <laughs> Last week, I infiltrated Burger King, replaced all their normal lettuce with foot lettuce. F O O T lettuce. Um. Are you a piece of foot lettuce? There's a piece of lettuce right here, but not in my head. Uh, More questions? No. Um, you don't want anything? Are you anything. depressed? But it, you don't go take Only it. sometimes. I don't know. But what then I sniff this and I get a whiff of honey. I guess it's of what? Okay, um, next to the. To the next question, do you want to go to Burger King and get a foot Burger King foot lettuce burger? F Burger King. Bye. Mr. Weasel. Hey, I'm trying to do the waiting school. <laughs> Stand over there. Yeah. And then you walk in. Oh, Obviously, you stand over there. No, I never asked about that. Who'd you think about the part? Tears family apart. <laughs> Wait, it's like worse. There's a this? bunch of stuff. Well, not a bunch of stuff. Why are you wasting his memory? Today, we have a round of guests with some <laughs> interesting backgrounds. But first off, let's give a hand. For Gene Nuisance, come on up. Oh, <laughs> oh, thanks for coming on the show. It's so nice to have you. So nice. So, first things first. We heard about the baby. How's that coming up? <laughs> Our first guest is particularly, particularly dumb. Our next guest came all the way from Australia. Give a warm welcome to Dr. Denman. Thank you so much for coming all the way from Australia. That is so crazy. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. It is truly an honor. <laughs> okay. What's wrong with <laughs> Our next guest? Wait, stop. I could hear her laugh. Yes, so, is this okay? Like, I suppose. Yes, yeah, so I heard, <laughs> I heard that you, um, for letting us in Better this hope this doesn't get 15 secret. million views. <laughs> Just keep going. <laughs> okay, bye. Why did you keep going? Our next, our final guest. Stop it. There's something. Also, I wanted to touch on my last video, Hotspot. Um, I'm sure some of you were co probably confused as to like some of the topics were done. Like I was talking to a unicorn, my sister, um, about fecal matter productions, and I know that's kind of gross. And believe me when I say I did not know where I was going with that. Um, if you don't know, Hotspot 
It started a few years ago um, on vacation with my family, an extended family. We made up this game, me and my cousins made up this game called Hotspot, where I was like Mr. Fabulous or whatever, and um, I actually would interview each of them, and like, it was kind of like, you have to try and keep it like as serious as possible. Uh, you can like ask any questions and they have to respond as if it's like real. So say, I would say, just off the top of my head, oh, um, how's your friend Barbie the doll or something like that, I don't know. And then they would have to come up with, oh yeah, she's doing great, blah, blah, blah. And um, yeah, so it's just like a really fun game we kind of made up and I thought it would be fun if we turned it into a video. So it was actually all live, like on the spot in my video too. So uh, I was like going off the top of my head, like all these different random things. First thing I said to my sister when she was being the unicorn was, so I heard about the baby and she lost it at <laughs> that. She just started cracking up. So I had to redo. So I actually had to, we actually had to redo and for whatever reason, the next thing I said was fecal matter productions, which I don't even know what that means, but yeah, all of those were just so random and just like off the top of our heads, so yeah, I just wanted to clear that up a bit.